this is our third demo in Red Hat Agile integration uh, platform. In the first demo, uh, we have seen how to uh, expose database over REST uh, interfaces using Red Hat Fuse Online. Uh, in the se second demo, uh, we have seen how to uh, expose those back and ABIs created by Fuse Online over uh, Red Hat uh, ABI Management 3 scale and how can we uh, secure those ABIs and provide the active documentation uh, and also uh, get the different analytics as well as the application uh, plans. In today's demo, uh, we are going uh, to demonstrate the other side of the uh, ABI management uh, development, which is the ABI developers. So once we create the ABIs uh, and create the different plans, the next step is uh, to engage the ABI developers to start consuming those uh, ABIs. So uh, ABI management uh, comes usually with what is called a developer portal. Uh, Red Hat 3 Scale ABI Management provides a developer portal that allows you to quickly uh, engage those ABI developers and uh, provide them with uh, the onboarding experience for them to sign up, to subscribe to existing ABIs and existing plans and start consuming the uh, ABIs. So uh, we have two ABIs right now created in Red Hat 3 Scale. Uh, the first one is the user's ABIs. The second one is the blog's ABIs, and both are uh, consuming uh, some uh, online ABIs. For example, the blog's is actually consuming the uh, GoRest Cohen, which is, again, set of uh, publicly available ABIs. Uh, and for the uh, users, again, it, it is, uh, again, consuming those uh, REST ABIs to uh, retrieve users, to create users, to update uh, users. So once those ABIs are created, the next step is uh, to expose those ABIs through the developer portal and make them available for the ABI developers. Uh, 3Scale comes with uh, a developer portal, which is a full-fledged content management system that allows you to create a custom content, which is nothing but, again, the standard HTML, as well as the uh, different assets between the style sheets, JavaScripts, and the media files. And also, uh, it has the uh, liquid script that allows you to interact with uh, three scale ABIs, right, to retrieve, let's say, the available services, the available plans, or to uh, provide a sign up experience or sign in experience through the uh, developer uh, portal. If we, for example, look at the home page, how does it look like? It's a standard HTML along with some liquid scripts that. Uh, allows you to interact with 3Scale. For instance, this uh, liquid script uh, checking whether a uh, user is logged in or not. So if the user is logged in, definitely the content will be uh, directed to this uh, user. Otherwise, we can show some public uh, content. Okay. So if you look at the developer portal, this is a developer portal, right? You have the home page where you uh, can show the different uh, ABI plans and also for uh, those developer ABI developers to browse the ABI catalog where they can, let's say, uh, filter based on a category or click on the specific ABI to read more about the uh, ABI, what is this ABI about, right? Uh, also the active documentation for this ABI, right? And also uh, the sign up process if you need to sign up for this ABI to start accessing it, either sign up or uh, click to see the available plans and some terms and conditions. Also, for the, uh, again, available documentation, right, for this ABI, you get the list of ABI, published ABIs, along with the active documentation for those ABI uh, developers to uh, look at uh, your uh, ABIs, how do they look like, and also uh, you have the uh, sign-up process. So, uh, in this demo, we will quickly uh, uh, walk through the uh, onboarding experience starting uh, from a uh, sign-up process. So uh, a D, an ABI developer needs to sign up. Let's create a new account, user2, using this email, providing the password. So once uh, the account is created, 
users will receive an email to confirm their email address and also administrators can see uh, the uh, created account and this account will be uh, definitely bending for uh, again approval so administrators can uh, simply activate this account and if you look at the account details again this is the organization and this is the uh, administrator so for, for every uh, developer account there will be one administrator and later this administrator can create different sub uh, accounts okay so the next step for uh, this ABI developer is to sign in right so user 2 password so once you log in right so if you have any uh, active uh, subscriptions or any active plans definitely they will show here otherwise you can create your own application if there is any uh, again uh, subscriptions uh, for you to start using the APIs so administrators can simply allow this uh, ABI developer to uh, subscribe to one of the available ABIs let's say the blogs ABI subscribe so if you go back to the uh, developer portal start creating application so definitely because it's only one uh, ABI uh, available for this uh, ABI developer to use uh, three scale will uh, select it by default otherwise if you go back to sorry before that if you go to applications you can also do the same no application by clicking create new application so definitely will take you to the blogs ABI otherwise if we subscribe also for the users ABIs plan subscribe and now let's go to the applications again try to create a new application good so now uh, three scale will uh, list down all the available abis right for you to uh, select which abi you need to uh, create an application or subscribe to so let's start with blogs abi so also uh, three scale will allow you to navigate through the available application plans right if there is any uh, again other plans you can simply select the plan and subscribe to specific plan otherwise because blogs ABI has only one application plan we'll just create one application so once this application is created because this application requires approval right so if we go back to this ABI developer and look at the applications right now there is an application created but this application is bending right because it requires an approval so we just accept this application and go back to the developer portal if we click on the applications right now we can see that the application is live let's create another application to access the users ABIs if we look at the different plans review and change now because users abis uh, has two different uh, plans one is basic plan that allows you to have 100 hits per day while the golden plan allows you to have 5000 hits per day so you can either select the basic or the golden plan that's fine we'll stick to the basic plan and give it users app users app and generate or create the application uh, this time because this application does not require approval so definitely the application is created and it is active and ready for uh, use if we go back to the applications we can see that again you have this uh, ABI developer has two different applications one is the again blogs app one is the users app and each application has its own ABI key if you go back to the administrator right and look at the demo right you can see that you have two different applications one actually uh, subscribe to this surface users ABI using API key or blogs ABI and this is the uh, plan right and also 
if you look at each and every application you will uh, see that there is an again application uh, key or user key created for this application uh, also uh, for us to understand how does it work the uh, ABI keys bare ABI administrators can configure whether users can manage their own applications or not right and also enable custom keys so users can create their own keys otherwise Cscale can uh, generate those ABI keys and assign them to users okay and also uh, here for the uh, application plans whether you allow ABI developers to uh, request plan change or change the plan directly this is again up to you uh, bear uh, ABI good so once the applications are created so what we can do now if we look at the documentation active documentation and this is the let's say the plugs ABIs these are the available ABIs let's say get list of users and this is the again expected response and also uh, you have the user key here if you click on the user key uh, Cscale will retrieve all the available uh, ABI uh, keys right we definitely need to use the blogs app and if we try it okay getting list of users here okay good we can also uh, do the same for the other ABI which is users API so let's get list of users also we will be using the users key try so getting list of users here okay if we try for example to retrieve user by ID so user ID 2 and we're using the again the users have try right so this is the uh, response so once you are okay right with again testing the ABI going through the active documentation the ABI developers are ready to integrate their uh, backend systems their mobile applications or uh, their uh, again integration uh, scenario through the uh, ABI uh, gateway so to quickly uh, recap right? so the developer portal is the place where all the ABI developers they come online uh, to navigate through the ABI catalog they can simply uh, navigate through the different ABIs they can uh, quickly look at the ABI uh, active documentation right each and every method what is the expected uh, parameters uh, what is the payload if there is a payload and also what is the uh, expected uh, response also they can test it if they have or if they have a valid subscription to this API uh, also uh, those users can subscribe to the uh, existing plans right so by creating a new application where you get all the available uh, ABIs so once you click on the ABI you simply get the list of available plans you select a plan and you subscribe to this plan create the application once the application is created you have different scenario whether this application does not require uh, an approval so you go ahead start using uh, the abis otherwise if it requires approval so administrators they have to approve the uh, abis so this is uh, again the uh, onboarding experience for ABI developers to come online and start using the ABIs. There are some other features including for example for the uh, ABI developer uh, administrator to be able to uh, for example uh, invite new users right so create sub accounts right and also can watch the uh, invitation and uh, once again uh, invoices are generated they can simply uh, get the uh, invoices and if the uh, developer portal is integrated with payment gateway they can also uh, pay uh, online